Welcome into MSA Sports Center Stage. I'm Craig Warnock, joined by Kiski Area Junior Matt McCutcheon, the 195-pounder. Matt, first off, I want to go back to your freshman year because we really start to have been the great wrestler up to this point in your junior season. But freshman year, you came in, kind of not too many people talking about you. Usually, the heavier weights, not too many guys as freshmen succeed as you did. But uh, you placed third in WPIL. Were you expecting that kind of success early on in your career? Uh, I wasn't expecting it. I was definitely hoping for it. It's one of my goals to work towards to get the stage. Were you nervous at all heading into uh, the freshman season? Yeah, there's a little bit of nerves there. Right. Especially in like the third playoff tournament. Yeah. Like that. Okay. Now, did you catch people by surprise, you think, a little bit? Not too many people expecting a freshman to succeed as you did? Uh, towards the end of the year, I think I caught a couple of people by surprise. Especially more of the seniors. Yeah. Now you came into last year, placed second in the state, fifth in the state, a great year. Did you feel any pressure coming in to, after your successful freshman year to have a good sophomore year? Yeah, I, there was a little bit of pressure, but I mean, I kind of expected more from myself. Is it a little bit of a down year you'd say for yourself? I mean, placing second. I wouldn't say it's a down year, I just expected more. I know one of the guys you wrestled against, Perry Hills, you guys wrestled several times. Yeah. You got the better of the Dark Battle Championship. In that match in particular, do you remember still to this day and kind of eating away at you a little bit? Yeah, it's, it's getting to me, but I can't wait to get back at him. I think we're going to wrestle this weekend, so good ride. Looking forward to it. Okay, now, wrestling in the WPIO Championship, I think that was a learning experience for you, especially in the finals there this past year. Yeah, it definitely was. Uh, getting the nerves out of me this year, I'll be a lot more quality. What was it like going into your first final? Was it really nerve wracking at all? Yeah, it was, it was. I had a bunch of nerves, so to be honest, but this year I've been super proud. Now, that loss, has it really motivated you throughout the offseason to get better? Yeah, this is my offseason this year. A couple kids for our team, we've worked hard, always trying to get in better shape this year. Now, in terms of coming into this season, you uh, talked about a little bit of preparation and everything like that. Now. Are you happy with your performance so far to this point? Yeah, so far. That's doing well. Keep it up though. I keep working. At the Mannheim Central Tournament, you were the champion of the tournament, but when you came into that, did you see some of the tougher kids you might see in terms of the whole state when you get into PIW level? Uh, there was a tough kid there from Easton. He ended up losing in the semi, so I didn't get to see him. I got to watch him wrestle a little bit. What do you see as some of your biggest obstacles coming into the rest of the season? Uh, right now, I'm on my way down to 182, so losing the weight and maintaining strength doesn't do it. Now, why are you deciding to drop down? Uh, best chance of winning state title. It's my goal this year, so. The same as the WPIO Championship? Yeah. You don't want to see Perry again in the WPIO final? I mean, I want to, <laughs> but I'll see him this week, so. No, Chuck Tursky, obviously, uh, doing a great job. He's going to be in the WPIO. Getting the most wins by a WPIO head coach. Uh, what's it like for us yeah. to head coach Chuck Tursky? Oh, it's awesome. He's been coaching me for a while now. I've always looked up to him as a coach. He's a great coach. And it's awesome to be part of the team. And he's going to break the record. Now, when he uh, comes in at the season, every year, I mean, you mentioned even younger looking up to him. Is that kind of thing, does that help more kids come out to the junior high level and senior high level because of Chuck Tursky? Yeah, the, uh, he's a great coach, so kids always think. They're going to get better if they come out with him. Uh, we had, I think, 40 or 50 kids in the junior high level expecting to get him. So. Now, Kiski area, obviously, always one of the top teams in WPIL. If it, you had your choice, would you like to have that last match be on you every time so you can win it for your team? Definitely. Yeah. Why is that? I love that feeling of winning for the team. Right. You got a chance to do that against Franklin Region and win the match. That was a great win for you. Any college ideas for you? I know you're a junior, so you still got a little while to decide that, but you start to think about that at all? Uh, looking around, I went for a visit to Lehigh, so colleges like that, Penn State, talking about that. Going to be wrestling there as well? Hopefully. <laughs> great. Well, best of luck throughout the rest of the season, man. I appreciate it. Thank you. That's the MSA Sports Center stage.